Hello, everyone. Uh, thank you for being here. It's awesome to uh, come back to share our communication in physical form in this awesome uh, place. No? Uh, OK. Uh, today, I, I'm going to talk about, about the uh, current topic for our study field, which is COVID-19 and open science analysis of evidence and trends to delivery and share information. OK, uh, the agenda for this presentation is made up with a brief introduction. First, open science, background, principles, and factors. Second, evidences on of, of actions of open science and COVID-19. And third, trends on open of science and final considerations. Uh, a brief introduction is that COVID-19 ha COVID has raised inform informational actions uh, for, for the development and implementation, in which uh, opening, um, opening, opening sharing and delivery information are in the focus global attention. Also, uh, COVID-19 uh, has reactivated a discussion about scholarly communication, such as subscription of crisis, uh, cost of editorial publishers, and need to uh, regulate uh, on, on normatives for uh, free open access or free uh, information, uh, among others. Uh, likewise, uh, availability of research outputs in open platform uh, for uh, assistant health crisis uh, is uh, provide you evidence for transition, transition on open science. Therefore, uh, the main of this contribution is that we based on this evidence, uh, analyzing and sustain paradigm shifts to open science, and review some trends that COVID-19 has uh, raised to openness of research. Okay, the first uh, part of this presentation is about the open science, backgrounds and principles. And in this slide uh, shows uh, some backgrounds about this, this movement, such as, uh, for, for example, in 1977, 1977 sorry, uh, was raised subscription of crisis. In 2002 and 2003 uh, were proclaimed trees B of open access, such as Bethesda, Berlin, and Budapest. In 2014, uh, was proposed uh, a begin, uh, beginning of second scientific revolution. In 2019, uh, <coughs> 2014, sorry, 19, sorry, uh, science uh, be, uh, was, was proposed that science wa uh, was a, 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 a good global public good. In, in 2020, was uh, published the recommendation on open science. In this sense, uh, open science have for general principles, uh, implement and expand actions to access collaborations, reproducibility, visibility, and management of data and research output financed with public funds. In this, in this sense, uh, it might define that open science is a paradig paradigm shift due to open all phases of research processes, ringing from designs to publications. Okay, open science, uh, uh, current concept of open science uh, has provided by UNESCO, which uh, was based on a global survey carried out in 2020 uh, in which different countries uh, shared their perspectives and approaches. And um, highlight factors in showing uh, concept uh, allows you to identify uh, main elements with uh, open science is constituted, uh, such as uh, implement fair, fair, fair principles and human rights, how social benefits, and provide you, provide you uh, main uh, pillars of this movement, such as uh, open access, open evaluation, open licenses, uh, open collaborations. Uh, in this sense, um, the second, the the second slide is that uh, other element relevant for open science 
is uh, the taxonomy, which made up uh, with the related factors to disseminate and strengthen <coughs> this uh, openness of processes of researchers. Some uh, main factors of open science are globalization, evaluation, infrastructure, open access, open policies, open uh, li licenses, citizen science, and others. Okay, uh, the second part of this presentation is our evidences of actions on open science and COVID-19. And so that uh, derivate from COVID-19, uh, we have uh, witnessed that uh, many institutions at global level opened their research outputs on open platform for their access and uses. Um, in these uh, slides shows uh, three main reference about how uh, open science has uh, implemented for openness, openness actions um, and provide you evidence that uh, those, uh, may, uh, those barriers and or limits uh, created were bring down to a uh, common uh, purpose. Uh, which uh, was titled Vaccine to er Eradicate mm, pa of Pandemic. Uh, for example, uh, the National Genomic Data Center uh, was first deposited on uh, the open access repository of the DNA uh, new coronavirus. UNESCO urged a uh, scholarly actors of scholarly communication look up ways for free access. And Promote uh, uh, in intensify scientific co cooperation and uh, uh, in the in the in between institutions around the world, and some institutions uh, which uh, work World Work Health Organizations and the White House and other institutions request their organization uh, openness uh, advances of research output to uh, to this gene. Okay, uh, this slide uh, shows um, two main reference about uh, how in the um, uh, uh, actions of open, si open science uh, are un unprecedented. And other reference uh, provide you elements that not all literature were, were, was uh, open. Uh, so, this set of evidence, uh, it might be, uh, might be defined that um, <clears throat> take care that open access does not return to limits and barriers that there were before of pandemic. Also, uh, it might define that never before have societies had such at a need for openness to information financed with public good as today. And it might define that open science in COVID-19 crisis uh, are toward uh, democratic, implement democratic access to delivery and sharing. Okay, third part of this presentation is about, is, is due to uh, COVID-19 has raised uh, specific trends about the open science, such as open data, preprints, and formalize this movement. So uh, the first trend is open data, and in, in this slide shows three main reference about how open, date, open data uh, has helped uh, global issues such COVID-19. So uh, literature, has uh, reference, reference that uh, open data, uh, success of open data uh, can help uh, for across the impl implement for principles and uh, the premise of being uh, access as possible as uh, close it is as necessary. Okay. 
Second trends uh, about the, the for the, for this work is preprints for openness of science and literature and evidence uh, provide just elements that considerate that these preprints uh, are uh, closely linked with the open science principles due to uh, promotes access to collaboration, reproducibility, visibility, and management of multiple information resources. Also. Um, uh, COVID-19 has promoted implementation of different platforms uh, for um, eradicate this uh, disinformation, uh, such as uh, shows in these slides. For example, for example, by your X-Right, X-Right, Socks Archive, the system COVID-19 SARS-CoV-2, Next Strain, the human coronavirus, and among others. So uh, the main Benefits, results, uh, and, and benefits. So, so for these uh, preprints, are in <coughs> will be open after the pandemic. A storage and preservation uh, data and open research, research outputs and scientific publications. Legitimation of these informations and provide promotes incentives and professional developments. The third trend on open, openings of science is harmonize and formalize open science. And as we have seen uh, before pandemic, uh, many informational resources were closed and limited uh, for their use and, and access. Also, um, a factor of good intention uh, is uh, uh, that which uh, open science uh, has been implemented uh, today um, are their, their, their factors, they need to be uh, harmonized and formalized uh, with two main uh, strategies. First, update and record uh, activities, uh, actions, recommendations, guidelines, uh, and others in public, scientific, educa educational, and uh, informational policies. And second recommendation is implement open licenses. Due to, let you remember that UNESCO recommended that open science exists thanks to implement the Creative Commons licenses specifically. And final consideration. Final consideration, uh, COVID-19 uh, crisis has presented evidences for um, a paradigm shift. Open data, concepts, typology, and attributes, metadata, schemas, fair principle are necessary. Preprint platforms as a, an alternative to implement transparent scholarly communication to date. Opening does not have elements that guarantee uh, the say, that say action will remain when pandemic is over pertinent, harmonize, and formalize open science with strategies at normalist is a necessity, is a reality. And encourage institutions make decisions about management, usufruct, access, and re uh, reuse for those information resources financed with public funds. And finally, consider an ideological change to implement actions for open science, for free access, for open access. <clears throat> Thank you for your attention.